The 2020 Tokyo Olympics are over, but rugby players Joe Jackson and Jeff Butler are gearing up for another competition, the Paralympics in Tokyo. We're all incredibly excited. We've been hitting each other, playing against our own teammates for the last five, you know, for the last for the last year here. And we're really excited finally to take the court against um, some other competition. Team USA has been training at Lakeshore Foundation for the last nine days. Butler says this is his second time competing in the Paralympics. He took home the silver medal after a double overtime loss to Australia at the 2016 Rio Games. It will be the first games for Jackson. Super excited, you know, like you see USA competing and then you see him winning and all of a sudden you're thinking about that. You're thinking about, oh, I can't wait to get on that court, compete, win, and just win as a family. While both players are excited to compete, they tell me the training during a pandemic has been challenging. It's been a lot of training by yourself with COVID hitting, you know, training outside, whatever you could do while stuff was closed. Knowing that at least especially in the run up to this camp that if you tested positive coming to this camp, you weren't going to go to the games. I think that was weighing pretty heavily on my mind and some of the other athletes was just that at home before this camp, it was really important to isolate. The team will head to Japan on Tuesday, one week from the start of the games. In Birmingham, Xavier Harris, WVTM 13.